Well, like most scientists, I became a scientist because of a great man. This was a professor at Pomona College, Alfred Woodford. I took a, a geology course from him, and he was he himself was so full filled with excitement and enthusiasm, and with 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 respect for the, for the remarkable really artistic and creative job that science does that I just never got over. His genius was the idea of having the college system. Originally envisioned as 12 colleges of about 2,500 students. Uh, now it's more like six colleges of 5,000. But his idea was that there should be a small group, smaller college that students feel an allegiance to. I think that the purpose that we're here for, the pride, the sense of community, I think that that's really stayed anchored in the tradition that Roger Revelle wanted. The notion of a comprehensive education that has been formed not by the student but by the faculty is still there. It's still intact. And it's based on a very simple principle. The people who are educated know something about what an education is, and people who aren't yet educated don't. And our students accept that. There was just this definite feel of excitement in starting a new adventure. The new adventure being the creation of a major research institution for undergraduates and graduate students. That was all a promise for the future. It now has proven that it has been successful. At the time, the energy was just palpable. You'd see it in the administration, you'd see it in your faculty, you'd see it in your fellow students. What really appealed to me about Ravel College in particular was that there wasn't a sense that the sciences and the humanities are separate. They complement each other, they inform each other, and that to be good at one is to be better at the other. And I think that was really important for me. Without Roger and Ravel College, we would have never grown to the amazing campus that we are today. Roger was always engaged, he was involved, he knew students, students knew him, and they knew that they were a part of history of UC San Diego. Just amazing. <laughs>